What's up, everybody? I'm the Night Robot Tsunami here with a review for Prey from Arcane Studios and Bethesda Software. Prey is a first person action shooter, sci fi, horror, stealth, roguelike, Metroidvania. There's, there's a lot. There's a lot to this game. The story of Prey is a little convoluted. You start with Morgan Yu on the spaceship Talos 1 and. I'm gonna leave it there because it's just, it's gonna get crazy. Every, if I start talking about the, the story, it's gonna get nuts, it's gonna get crazy. Let's just get right down to it. You have to try to find your way out. You have to kill a bunch of aliens. You have to go from point A to point B, except you can go 80 billion directions to go from point A to point B. Uh, and it's actually really neat. The gameplay is fantastic. The combat is really, really good and really, uh, really intuitive. I really like the way you can craft items. You can collect items, recycle them, and then craft them for later on. Uh, so, having ammo or med kits or glue for your glue gun, trust me there's a glue gun, it's crazy. Um, you never really feel like you're in short supply of that stuff, which is both a blessing and a curse because at no point did I ever think, oh I need to conserve my bullets. Uh, one of the coolest things was when I had to actually leave the space station and go floating in space uh, and sort of navigate through space and I thought that was awesome, it was so cool. The space center here is massive, it's pretty crazy uh, and I actually find myself going, back and forth quite a bit because you're going you're gonna to backtrack a lot uh, and every time you backtrack you're going to find a new way to get from where you previously were or back to where you need to go and I think it's really neat the way they designed that uh, and the level design about it is really cool because you really just can't go through the same route twice. Uh, you will never get bored expo exploring this area. So this, this is kind of not awesome but awesome I guess it could have been back on the other side. The enemies in this game. Uh, you are killing this thing's called the Typhon, um, and they are ridiculous, they're mimics, that means they can show up at any time, any place, and uh, I joke that Prey is giving me trust issues because you will find what you think is just a normal coffee cup, and blah, 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 like it's this crazy thing that's gonna come at you and kill you, and it's, it's, it's so, it makes you jump, it's scary, it's ridiculous, and it's, uh, I hate those guys. The world might be a little too big, uh, because I feel a lot of times where I get lost uh, trying to find where I'm supposed to go and I end up in a, in a spot with enemies that are much higher difficulty than what I am currently at for my character uh, and so there's a lot of times where I die really easily. Another thing about the game uh, that I wish could have done better is a lot of the story. There is a lot of story that are that's not told to you directly, so there's a lot of exploring. If you if you love exploring, then you're gonna go crazy. You're gonna be able to like hack into terminals and computers, read emails, and do cool stuff like that. However, if you are not into that and just want to play through a game, you're gonna miss out on quite a bit of backstory. Um, and I got a baby, so it's kind of hard for me to play through a game that's going to take a chunk of time uh, unless I play at night and don't sleep. Uh, so I do find myself skipping through a lot of things. Uh, I really wish I, I wasn't doing that because the world in Prey is really cool and really well done. Arcane Studios and Bethesda have put out an amazing game. I wish I had more time to play it because I know that I am going to continue to go back to it. And the, what saddens me about it is I feel that at times I may end up putting the game down picking it back up a little bit later down the road, but not actually knowing where I was and sort of having to re-familiarize myself with the game. Prey is out now for Windows, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. Uh, it's 60 bucks, and to be honest, totally worth it. Uh, I really think that if you were looking for a great sci-fi stealth horror shooter, crazy recycling, scary game that's gonna give you nightmares and give you trust issues, totally worth it, in my opinion. Uh, like I said, I wish I had more time to play, but I actually think this is going to be one of those games that's either going to be a sleeper hit and you're going to hear about it later on so your friends are like, man, that game was so good, why didn't I get it? Or you're just going to get it and love it. If you got a chance to check out Prey, I'm going to put a link below to where you can find it online. Uh, so check it out, make your own decision. You're an adult, you can do what you want. I'm the Mike Robles, I'll see you online.